Hey yo, what's good? NX Medi here with another video. I have this beat I've been working on for a while, so I'm just gonna do a quick breakdown. This is more like a remake. Someone sent me a sample. Like I use this as a guideline, not like I'm to re replicate it entirely. I had to use it as a guideline to get a vibe he was going for. I can't play back the audio right now, this particular audio right now, because he sent it to me on WhatsApp. I can't play it back now because of copyright issues. So, so as you can see, there are like three samples inside one pattern. So, the first one I got from this drum, and this is the bank, Electric Clean, and the program being this number 38, the Lonely Jam. And I did some tweaks and stuff. I did a lot of EQ, I cut off some of the low end. And some of the modi and i boosted some of the high need so i'm just gonna play back before and after so you can listen to what it sound like as you can hear it sounds too modi so now it's clean now and i put another strum gs again and this time, from the same bank, but I'll be using this number 71 as the show drop. And this is the pattern I made. And I have this guitar one shot here just to replicate that live vibe. So it's already played up. And so I'm just gonna play everything together so you can listen to what it sounds like. As you can see, this gives you some some sort of live free gaming. Now, with the main melody out of the way, I came up with this pattern. This time, I'll be using the double cross. And it's basically repeated the what I did the first time. I'm just gonna cut off some of the low end there. And so I'm pulling out this triton. And if you've been following this channel for a while, you'll notice that I use these legato strings a lot, like a lot. So how I got it from the library bank strings, and it's always the, the first at the top here. And this is what I made. I'm pulling up this muffin. I these are one of my first um synthesizers I used, like one of the bursts I used before I, I laid my hands on other synths. The sound I'm using is this wind flute from the brass and wind. This is the number 12 here, wind flute, and you see. And so when I play back. And it just plays the same thing over and over again. And I have this vision coil. The articulation I'm using is R, and this is what I made. And I added lots of reverb. And put a bump pass EQ. And next one, I put out flex. Yeah, you know the flex that comes with efforts to the ear. And I'm going through essential wings and trumpet sustain. I didn't do any tweak here. If I'm just doing any tweak, you always be in, in the mixer where I have more controls. This is what I made. Added some reverb.
And then I had this one shot. Um, this guitar one shot. And I added lots of reverb, like lots of reverb. And as you can see, the decay is more than um 11 seconds here. If you look over to this place, 11.6 seconds. And the dampening is so wide. And the size uh 54 is okay. That's what I'm using. And and after to give me a thick a thick ambient sounds like i'm going to use more of it at the chorus during the chorus i'll use some of it at the intro but it may, mainly is meant for the chorus so i'm going over to the drums now and as usual start off with the shakers I made these room shots. Now I rest now. Then I made this kick pattern. And I'm adding this clave. And I'm adding this perk. And I also added this room shorts. And I also added this room shorts. And then I added the. Fuck. I don't even know what you're saying. <laughs> and then I added this Congo. And then I added this Tom. And lastly, I made this A, -A pattern. I made this crash and roll. And I'm gonna do some mix and play everything back. So this is what everything sound like together. Unless I forgot, I added this um, vinyl effects just for the intro. This is the best part right here. And as usual, smash that subscribe button, like and drop a comment in the comment section what else you want me to do in the next video. Until next time, peace out. Peace out. Peace out. Peace out. Yeah.